I've always had an interest in the natural world, so I just really always had a, an affinity to being outside and I've always loved animals and knew that I wanted to do something with animals and when I learned about being a conservation biologist that seemed like a good fit for me. I get to be outside, I get to do work that I think really makes a difference and that has a good purpose. In Otay Mesa, San Diego Zoo Global is studying burrowing owls to look at their reproduction and their survival and to better understand threats to their, to their conservation. We're here in this area because this is actually the last remaining population of breeding burrowing owls in San Diego County. And so we're trying to help the land managers here understand the population better so that we can better conserve them for the future. Burrowing owls are these awesome little owls that live in the ground. They're the only owl in North America that lives in burrows in the ground. They're only about six inches tall. They're not very tall at all, so they fit in the palm of my hand. Burrowing owls need um, burrows in the ground, and usually they're dug by ground squirrels or prairie dogs or other animals that dig burrows. We call them fossorial animals. Because of people not liking them digging holes in the ground, they've gotten rid of a lot of those animals. And so now the owls don't really have homes that they need. We are trying to build better habitat for them by building more, more grassland and by building burrows that they can live in. We're trapping owls to be able to put leg bands and GPS data loggers on them. In order to trap the owls, we take advantage of the fact that they like their burrows and they're very tied to their burrows. So we set up little traps at the burrow entrances and then when they try to get in or out of the burrow, they are stuck in this little box trap that we also bait with a mouse and sometimes we also bait with, a, with playback of another owl making a, a vocalization. Once the owls are in the traps, we take them back to the vehicle and we do a whole processing of the owls. So we weigh them, we measure, take different body measurements on them, we apply leg bands to them, and in some cases we also put a GPS data logger on them. In order for us to be able to track the movements of growing owls, we have to use GPS data loggers. So we put them on as a, a, little, a little backpack and then we can record their locations at various times throughout the night. The data logger information that we get is giving us a location and it's allowing us to look at where they're, where they're looking for food and to better understand how far away from the burrows they move to try to find food and to better help land managers understand what kind of habitat needs they have. I feel really hopeful that what we're doing at San Diego Zoo Global is going to help land managers and wildlife managers in San Diego County moving forward with burrowing owl conservation. It's a pretty hot topic right now and we're lucky enough to have a population of breeding owls here and I think that it's really on a lot of people's radar right now to try to conserve the owls that we have and because we're learning so much about these owls I think we're able to, to give them a better idea of, of the information they need to make decisions about how to move forward with development in the area. Thank you.